Hello and welcome back again to my YouTube channel. My name is Doris Etito. In this video, I will be sharing with you how much YouTube paid me for 1000 view. I said I will be discussing or showing you my analytics how much money YouTube paid me for 1k view before we go into my YouTube studio to share with you guys these details. I would like to let you know that there are some factors to consider or there are factors you should consider to determine how much they pay each uh, creator. Those factors are CPM, RPM, audience retention, geographical era of your viewers, view count and age bracket of your viewers. Let's get deeper into this. Like I earlier stated, the first factor to consider or the first factor YouTube consider to determine how much money they pay a particular creator or how much money YouTube paid me is the CPM. Now, what is CPM? CP CPM simply means cost per meal, okay? That is the cost, um, the amount of money um, the advertisers is willing to pay you know youtube is a platform they are a business people okay they are business people so when an advertiser come to youtube they bring a certain amount of money for for youtube to play their ads on a video okay so it depends on how much money these advertisers bring on the table that will determine how much cpm youtube is going to offer so cpm is the cost per meal how much money advertisers are willing to pay per 1000 view okay and remember cpm is usually shared between uh um creator and youtube okay um i think it's 40 60 please correct me in the comment section if that is not correct next factor to consider is rpm just like cpm rpm is the revenue per meal okay so revenue per meal is how much money youtube is going to pay a creator per 1000 view cpm is how much how much money the advertisers are willing to offer youtube per 1000 views and rpm is how much money revenue youtube is going to pay a creator per 1000 view take for example um an advertiser brings say is willing to pay hundred dollar let's put it that way hundred dollar per hundred dollar is big <laughs> okay i think there's some people with that kind of high cpm but let me just use mine as a case study let's say um advertiser brings eight dollar per as the cpm okay eight dollar for one thousand views okay that's a cpm youtube is not going to pay you four dollar if they pay you four dollars it means it's 50 50. sometimes youtube can pay you um three dollar two dollar one dollar or even 50 or 40 cents now the, the there are some other factors that can influence how much um cpm you get okay so there are some factors that some basic factors under these factors to consider that we actually determine how much or whether your cpm is higher whether your rpm is higher or not now this brings us to the third factor you to consider to determine your cpm or your rpm or how much money that they are going to pay you audience retention now this is a key factor to determine even the cpm and your rpm now a good audience retention will give you a higher cpm and as well a higher rpm a low audience retention can give you um, a not so good cpm and a not so good rpm and this is the determined factor in fact your audience retention is key it is key in determining how much your cpm or your rpm is going to be and that will influence how much money youtube is going to pay you per 1000 views now when we talk about audience retention i mean how much time your viewers are willing to spend or they are spending on your videos i'm talking about engagement c 
simply put engagement now if you upload a video say for instance you upload a 10 minutes video and your audience or your viewers give you audience retention of five minutes of 10 minutes video that is that is good you understand that's like half time of the entire video you have uploaded and that will determine how much cpm or rpm you are going to get now the next factor to consider is your viewers geographical location now where are people watching you from if you have audience or viewers from uk um america canada germany these um viewers or these views from these countries their cpm or rpm is high or higher than countries like nigeria um which other country ghana india if you have viewers from these countries like i mentioned with higher cpm that will also determine how much your rpm or your cpm is going to be and i have a video that this that this um audience geographical location um how it's significantly affected my cpm and my rpm i will be showing you that video analytics in a bit now another factor to consider or another factor that determines how much um money youtube is going to pay or what is to consider is your view count the last i have listed out here is age bracket of viewers now who are the people watching you now if you have more viewers that are say 24 age brackets 18 to 24 24 to 35 and you have other age brackets of viewers watching you say um 40 to 60 35 to 50 or 60 to you know those a those um, age brackets of viewers that are way older to give you to the impression that these people they have more purchasing power remember youtube is an advertising platform now advertisers coming to youtube to run ads on your video they are looking for potential clients you understand now if you have people watching you say um your viewers they are between their ages are between 18 to 25 these people they are most likely not going to um visit those websites or visit those brands or advertisers simply because they may be um young adults um, who are still mm, not in the workforce yet they are not working or they are working and not any so much so the the possibility that they are going to click on those ads playing on your video is low but when you have age viewers with age bracket from say 35 40 50 60 their their uh, purchasing power is way higher the the likelihood that they are going to click on those websites or they are going to click on those brand to visit those advertisers or to even make a purchase or make a do a transaction a valid transaction a successful transaction is way higher i hope you get the point all right now having said all of this let's go into my youtube studio to show you these videos and how these factors cpm rpm um audience retention uh, geographical location of your viewers view count i don't know but yeah i listed view count and the age bracket of your viewers how these factors into determining how much youtube is going to pay you for 1000 views let's go there now i'm about to show you my youtube studio from my phone now the first thing i'm going to do now is to click youtube studio okay let's go to my content now now we have these videos right let's go to a video with 1000 views let me show you how much youtube paid me let me start with this video this video the my first youtube paycheck this video is currently sitting on 2600 views and i uploaded this video two weeks ago just so the average view duration for this particular video is two minutes 41 seconds right, so let's go to the main the main which is the revenue now for this video the estimated revenue is five dollars 79 cents meaning youtube is telling me that 
this is how much i may get from this video oh i have gotten so far the revenue for every 1000 views that is the rpm is two dollar 17 cents how much um advertisers pay for this video since it was published is four dollar 60 cents that is the playback base cost for every 1000 views now if you look at the cpm look at the rpm you will clearly know that this is not a 50 50 um sharing um, method or i don't know if it is uh it's looking like it's looking not okay i think this is almost like a 60 40 or if it's a 50 50 i don't know please but let me know in the comment section now you see this cpm and the rpm just look at this okay now let's go to engagement um now look at the audience retention they the viewers they watch this particular video for two minutes 41 seconds let's look at another video okay let's look at this video we are moving to ghana let's just go to revenue straight up now this video has gotten me eight dollar estimated revenue for this video is eight dollars 17 cents oh now look at this look at my cpm and look at my rpm my cpm for this video is 6.35 dollar and the rpm for this video is two two dollar 65 cents the r the cpm for this video is six dollar 35 cents while the rpm is two dollar 65 cents now this is the reason why i said um youtube and content creators they don't share um revenue or they don't share ad revenue is 50 50 now this is 6.35 dollars right six dollar 35 cents and they are giving me rpm of two dollar 65 cents okay now remember the audience retention for this video went down it's about um two minutes 12 seconds right now where did this where did my viewers which is the viewers geographical location playing a if a major role where are they where did they watch me from okay let's see i didn't even check the other one pardon me okay now oh this is something i i did not check from the other video age bracket of viewers now if you look at this video you will see that the age bracket of viewers is the people that watch the most uh are between 35 to 45 years old which is 31.3 percent meaning that these people because their purchasing power is high there is every tendency that they may have clicked on the ad that played on this video as well as people that watch are also from between age 45 to 54 age 55 to 64 and 65 years and above now i also have viewers who a who age bracket are between 25 to 35 years old which is sitting on 25 percent okay and look at what i need you to see the top geographies where did they watch this video from so the most place where my viewers came from are from united states for this particular video united states which is 18.2 percent ghana 15.4 percent united kingdom the uk 13.0 percent nigeria 7.3 percent and germany 6.88 percent and i think this is the major factor why the cpm and rpm for this particular video is high the the viewers geographical location where they watch the video from is a factor to consider now let's go back to i'm sorry this video is beginning to be too long but i just want to point this out to you let's go back to this particular video okay now let's look at the audience for that particular video the first video now look at the age bracket of this video 
the people that watch the most they are between 25 to 35 years which is still good and 34 to 44 years and 18 to 24 years which is still good now look at the top geography where did they watch this video the most from nigeria <laughs> followed by the united states and kenya okay nigeria united states kenya ghana uk it means that these people the people that watch the most was from nigeria just assuming assuming people that watch the most was from united states i'm very sure the cpm and rpm would have been higher than what i got okay now let me show you another video because it seems like i'm showing you the the best before the worst okay so don't don't get it twisted don't think it's all sweet or rosy okay because these two i have shown you they look good and you'll be like oh oh it's good but let me show you one that will shock you in fact if you see this kind of rpm and cpm you will just tell yourself that i don't want to do again you see this 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 kind of adds suitability and if you see it on your video or more hmm, you're not gonna like come okay i uploaded this video last year december during vlogmas and this video got me 1001 views how we prepare our home for christmas when i saw that this video was up to 1000 views i was happy i was happy until i realized the reason why the cpm and rpm was low now look at this video performance views 1100 impression click to rate high 9.3 and look at the average view duration 1 minute 28 seconds it means that for the over 1000 people that watched this video they only watched it for 1 minute 28 seconds and that was what made the video uh cpm rpm to be what it is now let's look at the audience um information now look at the the age brackets of those that watch this video they are between 25 to 35 okay 35 to 45 not so bad and now look at where they watch the video the most from nigeria uk ghana and us and italy i think i have people or viewers watching me from countries with very good cpm una thank you those of you all my viewers and uh, subscribers watching me from these countries with good cpm god bless una god bless una because since i've been checking these things i'm just beginning to understand that people that watch me the most or watch me after nigeria they are from countries with high cpm and all of that okay for this particular videos they watch the most from nigeria now nigeria cpm cpm from nigeria viewers are lower than that of uk united states and i don't know about ghana okay but just assuming the the this number was just assuming the highest was from united united kingdom and my audience retention is not sitting at one minute 28 seconds the case would have been different i would have gotten a way better cpm and rpm look at the estimated revenue this video will give me or has gotten me seven to six cents only so for the hard work of filming this video i only get 76 cents averagely now look at the <laughs> look at the rpm and cpm for this video now the R the cpm for this video is three dollar eighty cents it means that how much advertisers have paid so far since i've published this video is three dollar eighty cents and how much is youtube going to give me for every one thousand views for this particular video it is 69 cents it means for every one thousand view i get i i, I get I get to be paid only 69 cents which is way 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 low and that when i saw it i'm like oh for so all this hard work i'm only getting 69 cents now if you get this kind of cpm rpm you will not be encouraged to make videos you'll be like what's the point so even if you get 3000 views you get very little um revenue okay it means you just multiply 69 cents times three <laughs> that's do the math and let me know okay take you to one video i have found very interesting so far now 
now let's look at this video this video is six six hundred and eighteen views this video is not up to one thousand view yet but guys look at the video performance this video is six hundred and sixteen views since it has been published and yeah this video average view duration is five minutes 57 seconds it's is a 25 minutes plus video but this video have a good audience retention and this is very good so let's look at the video details now the first thing to check on this video let's see where our audience are coming from okay now look at the age bracket of this video now the people that watch this video the 100 percent is between age 25 to 35 years meaning their purchasing power is not so much but here there are some people in this age bracket that are working that may likely click on ads um that display that may likely visit advertisers okay which is still fine but you see those other age bracket 35 to 45 and the rest they did not watch and where did they watch this video the most from my country brothers my nigeria people followed by united states united kingdom and ghana now let's look at the revenue the cpm and rpm for this video now this video that has gotten me only 616 or 618 views this video has gotten me two dollar 95 cents very very impressive now look at the cpm and rpm of this video this will wow you right the cpm for this particular video is 11 point 11 dollar 85 cents and the rpm for this video is four dollar 79 cents for every 1000 views this video um as we get me youtube is telling me advertisers they will pay 11 or they have paid 11 dollar 85 cents and youtube is telling me they are going to pay me for the revenue they are going to pay me for every 1000 views is four dollar 79 cents now i begin to wonder why this video has not gotten me three three thousand views five thousand views so that i will make money from this video just imagine if this video has gotten me three thousand views meaning four dollar 79 cents times three this is way better than um 0.69 0 dollar 69 cents you understand so this is what i have been trying to let you know guys guys i've been showing you my youtube studio my analytics i hope i have been able to communicate the message to you much money youtube paid me for 1000 views and the factors that determines what um, amount of money or how much money youtube is going to pay or the factors that or factors to consider or factors that youtube considers to determine how much money they are going to pay or how much revenue a content creator is going to get and these factors like i mentioned has to do with your cpm your rpm your audience retention your viewers geographical location where your viewers are watching you from the age bracket of your viewers and i said viewer view counts and i think that is not really necessary but yeah i listed that out i hope you have enjoyed watching this video i hope you have learned something today i hope i have opened my nash for you to see <laughs> okay i haven't shown you all of this i hope you have enjoyed watching this video like i said don't forget to give this video a thumbs up leave me a comment share it if you can and i will just leave the video on my first youtube paycheck here for you to see just in case you like to watch this video just in case you like to share in my joy and i'll see you again in another video please if you like videos like this that has to do with youtube um revenue and stuff like this let me know in the comment section and i'll try as much as possible to come out and do videos like this thank you for watching i'll see you again in another video goodbye